I think the School of Industrial and Labor Relations is a school for leaders, and it's a school that breeds and creates leaders. Even if you look at the Cornell campus, in all of the top student leadership positions, they are held by ILR students. And the student trustee, the essay presidents, all of these positions, uh, they're held by students in this school. And so I think that's really what ILR does best, is it teaches you how to lead a group of students, how to lead a group of workers, how to understand the problems people are facing, and how to understand business or any organization from the ground up. In high school, I really enjoyed social studies, and I always enjoyed getting into debates and um, you know thinking critically about things. Um, and so I think that drew me to ILR, just being the intersection of policy and the intersection of law and business and really studying things from the ground up. Um, and so I think that's what attracted me to the ILR school. In addition, it's just such a unique major and such a unique school that I couldn't find anywhere else. Something you know I learned about finance was that it was really just the study of businesses and how they work and um, studying you know their problems, studying how to make them better, how to make them more efficient. And that's something we learn right here in the ILR school is, is how to make companies work better. So I'll be joining uh, financial services industry, JP Morgan, in their investment banking division. Uh, specifically in their healthcare group. So I think ILR really prepared me for that by focusing on looking at the workplace and looking at organizations and how they work and how they tick um, is I think really what prepared me for a role in finance um, and knowing you know what problems organizations are facing, how to fix them, um, and really looking at it from an analytical perspective. And so I think that's really how ILR helped me for a job in finance.